Hi, uh, my name is Jared Rausch. I am a funded master's student at Indiana University in Bloomington. And I have some note cards here. Hope that's okay. Try to not waste too much of your time. Uh, I'm not sure if you've seen this in my personal history uh, statement, but when I was in my early 20s, my father got diagnosed with um, ALS and he died eight weeks later. And my mom, who already had uh, stage four metastatic breast cancer, um, I became her caregiver uh, for the next 14 months until she also died. Um, so my life went upside down. Uh, grades, finances, relationships, both personal and professional, just all tanked. Um, I was lost and I kept finding myself wondering how the doctors who gave my dad a two and a half year life expectancy, how they could be so wrong, because it was only eight weeks. Um, math, particularly probability theory, gave me a sense of direction. Um, and now I hope to use the fields of probability theory, um, data science, machine learning, uh, high dimensional statistics, just to, to push to, to provide better, more accurate answers to these questions that families so desperately need answers to, if that makes sense. Um, yeah, so why Quran? Uh, it has a ton of opportunities, uh, great people to work with, such as Professor Fernandez Granda and Professors, Professor Niles Weed. Both of them do amazing work and probability theory and um, statistics and uh, machine learning, everything that I am jazzed about. And um, it has, Quran also has amazing resources such as the um, math and data group at um, Quran's, at NYU and Quran, you know, at their center for data science. Um, and they, those, you know, the math and data group, they explore deep learning, probability, machine learning, high dimensional statistics. Um, machine learning, which I am actually a founding officer of the Machine Learning Club for Research at IU, so I think I could help provide an outside New York perspective. And um, I also did a project that I'm about to share with you. Uh, for a statistical computing class in R here at IU, um, we, my partner and I, used manifold learning techniques for nonlinear um, dimension reduction. Uh, it uses ISOMAP and it approximates Riemannian distances with the shortest path distances. And it approximates the shortest path distances with Euclidean distances in multi-dimensional, using multi-dimensional scaling. So it constructs a Euclidean representation of the geodesic structure, um, which is unique up to rigid motion. So really what we're saying is that if we look at pretty much a manifold, so this is a circle in three space. I don't know if you guys can really see these uh, printed outputs, but think of this as being in three space with some noise, as long as it has it's locally a manifold, um, we can uh, pretty much take find the shortest path distances between any two points and then give it a Euclidean representation. So then this length of these two points would be then preserved as let's say like this, and this again is just unique up to rigid motion. Um, why, are, why is Quran a good match? Uh, my personal history gives me a sense of drive um, to work in applied math and data science. And as a uh, proud gay man, I feel like I would be adding to the diversity of a field of STEM fields, which are largely underrepresented by gay men. Um, thank you for your time and consideration. Really appreciate it.